Hello, my NARC Free family. My name is Cree, and today I wanted to go over a very important uh, component to no contact. And I wanted to tell you what no contact is not. Some of you may be thinking because you've read articles or you've watched a YouTube video and it says uh, something to the effect that, you know, if you go no contact, this will hurt a narcissist or this will, um, you know, cause them a narcissistic injury, which bruises their ego. And so some of you are mad with the narcissist and you want to just do something to hurt them or you want to do something that you think will cause them to come running back to you and um, begging for your love back and be begging for you back. Well, some of you are going to get a response that you don't want to get if you play with this no contact um, and you run game on the narcissist and you try to manipulate them, okay? They're master manipulators. You're not. Don't get in games you can't play, okay? So, when you do something like that and you decide you're going to go no contact with them and then they don't reach out to you and they don't come begging for you back, this is when you find out how really unimportant you were to them, okay? Because if they've already got new supply set up, then they don't need you anymore. They have a new fuel source that you didn't know that they were working on in the background the whole time that you were with them. So no contact is not meant for trying to run game on the narcissist, trying to manipulate the narcissist, or trying to hurt them. No contact is not for that, okay? No contact is for your protection. It's for your healing. It's for getting you out of the web of deception and breaking the trauma bond for you so that you can be better. It has nothing to do with hurting the narcissist or trying to make them feel the kind of pain that you feel by the things they do to you. You're, they're never gonna feel that pain they don't feel the way that we feel they don't have the same kind of emotions that we have um, as a matter of fact they don't allow themselves to be vulnerable like that anyways so they're not connecting to you anyways if you do that you run the risk if you are doing it with this kind of heart to hurt the narcissist but you still want them in your life when you do that you are going to risk the chance that they come back and when they do reach out to you and the gig is up and you, you feel like you've gotten what you wanted, you have failed to understand that they now have to punish you for having played a game with them. When you go no contact with the narcissist, you do it intentionally and you do it for permanence you don't plan on on taking this back when you shut them down you shut everything down i have a video on the power of no contact and i recommend you uh listening to that video and i'll leave it at the end of this one i wrote a couple of notes um it is it is not to manipulate or punish the narc to get them to see the error of their ways i think i said this uh, it's for your freedom um it is no contact is hard for you to stick to anyways, okay? So when you decide you're going to do it, you need to do it for the right reasons. And I would recommend you writing a list for all the reasons why you are going no contact. You don't want to be abused anymore. You don't want to feel bad anymore. You don't want the push-pull. You don't want to be addicted. You want to know who you are. You want a life... Um, that revolves around your dreams and your goals. You don't want to be a slave to the narcissist anymore. That is the purpose of no contact. What it is not is manipulating the narcissist. That's not the purpose of no contact, okay? So I hope that this clears that up because I don't want y'all to get punished. Because in, in the punishment from the narcissist, some of y'all are going to end up taking them back because you played with no contact thinking you were getting... Um, you know, you were going to get under their skin and you were going to get what you wanted and manipulate them into doing what you wanted. And I was listening to um, a video by Pink Girl Teaches, Joy. Uh, you can go check her channel out. And she was talking about, you know, how they'll do something um, 
like, you know, tamper with protection, okay, so that they can, you know, um, in some kind of way manipulate you or or give you some sexually trans transmitted disease or you risk the chance of them getting you pregnant or you getting them pregnant um things like that that you weren't planning on you just thought that you were playing with the narcissist and you thought that nothing was going to happen and now you got a full-blown situationship <laughs> with a forever and sometimes they want you to be their forever supply so when they punish you they're coming back with a vengeance so you don't want to play with it when you shut them down you shut them down for good okay i hope this has been beneficial to you all if it has go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel i'm getting tongue-tied here and um thank you for joining me today and do check out the other video the power of no contact okay thank y'all so much again bye bye my beautiful narc free family mm -hmm.